hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel and in this video i will show you to create an interactive circle in your wordpress elementor website so let me show you first of all you can see this is wordpress website and let me show you plugins that i have installed so here you can see elementor pro and elements kit and essential add-ons for elementor so these plugins are installed and after that let me go to elementor editing mode so actually this element is you can use like when you want to explain about a project plan or uh, like any other type of plan that you want to explain after that just click on plus icons and next here we can select one column or two column so at this time i want to select one column after that just click on plus icon and search for circle so you can see this this is the element that comes with essential add-ons so just drag and use it so after that by default it has six parts one two three four five six so next here you can see these are some preset styles so you can change whatever you want to like you can see this is the layout so these are great layouts after that at this time i want to use first one so next here if you want to hide icon so just click on no you can see icon is hide it after that you can also hide text so the next is content tab and if you want to remove one of these how you can do that so just scroll down and just click on cross icon so you can see one item has removed after that how you can change the text so just click on first icon and edit icon or text so if you want to replace icon just go to icon library after that here you can see a couple of icons that you can select so let me select this one so you can see it has changed icon after that you can give a title like project plan So next, here you can see these are some tabs. This is button tab, after that content tab. So here you can add your own content. So for example, I want to remove this one. So you can see it has updated text. So I can add here text. Project planning will be discussed in this part so whatever text you want to add you can easily do that and after that so this is style if you want to add anything on background you can easily add okay so this was for first in this way you can change text or anything on other parts so like i want to change processing so you can see it has changed and also if you want to remove this one and add your own text in this part about the work process and menu so in this way you can add your own text and when you click on any of these icons so it will show its related, related content so you can see here if I select here so it shows me this content and after that if I click on processing so it shows this content so these are some great features and after that you can see 
by default this is click and if you want to change to hover so how you can do that so you can see if I hover over it is changing automatically so these are great features and using advanced technologies that's called Ajax after that here you can add animation wow this looks great and at this time I want to select none after that here this is style tab so you can increase or decrease circle width so I think by default it looks good and after that you can add padding margin border type so if you want to add border just click on solid and add a width so you can see here that's great and after that scroll down so next here you can see these are some items and you can change item colors so you can see colors are changing accordingly and after that if you want to change text color to white so this looks great after that you can change icon color so next you can change title size from family border type so also you can change hover color hover background color and icon hover color and many more so next this is content tab so you can change contact content color background color and many more so thank you for watching video